Hello friends, welcome to Pluto and the planets. Remember to like, subscribe and hit the notification button. Let's go! Hello friend, it's me Pluto. Today I'm going to show you all the planets. Hello Pluto, it's nice to meet you. Pluto, I have a question. Are you a planet? Yes, I am one of the planets you will learn about today. I am a dwarf planet, which means that I am smaller than other planets. My name is Tindo. I'm an astronaut. I visit space from planet Earth by a spaceship. It's good to meet you, Tindo. Let's first visit the solar system, shall we? Yippee! I can't wait to see all the planets. Meet Mercury, the smallest planet. Hi, Mercury. To the sun is the closest planet. Mercury takes 88 Earth days to have a year. But its entire day takes Earth 176 days to clear. I have a question to raise, Pluto. Shouldn't years take longer than days? Well, that's not always the case, Tindo. Planets move in two ways. In two ways? How, Pluto? First, on its own axis, like a dancer on a pirouette. And secondly, around the sun on a path called the orbit. I think I get it, Pluto. First on its axis, then in an orbit around the sun. That's right, Tindo. I slowly turn on my axis so my days are longer. In orbit, I'm quick, so a year takes shorter. Wow, Mercury! It was nice meeting you. Pluto, who are we meeting next? Next is Venus, named for the Roman goddess of love. Hi, Venus. It's nice to meet you. Of all the planets, Venus rises above. What does that mean, Pluto? It means that while all other planets spin their axis counterclockwise, Venus turns the other way, unlike the rest of the flock. This makes Venus upside down. Can you see, Tindo? Oh, Pluto, that's so funny. And it was nice to meet you, Venus. Who are we visiting next, Pluto? Planet number three is your very own planet. It is Earth, the one you call home. I know this one, Pluto. 70% of its surface is water. Yes, Gino. This is the only known planet where humans like you can live. Yes, that's because it has oxygen which we can breathe and water which we can drink. Let's go to the fourth planet, Tindo. Mars, the fourth planet, is also fondly called Red. It has two moons, Deimos and Phobos. That must be so cool, Pluto. It's like having two friends all the time. 
If you think that's cool, Tindo, wait till you hear this fun fact. Mercury, Venus, Earth and Mars are not just neighbors by the nearest star, but also compact balls of rocks and metals. They are planets called rocky or terrestrial. Wow, Pluto! That is why they are called terrestrial. Now I know. Thank you, Pluto, for teaching me that. Where are we off to next, Pluto? To the bigger planets we go. Are we going to the one with rings and another with a big spot? That's correct, my little astronaut. Watch out for the rocky objects floating. What are these objects, Pluto? And why are they floating in space? They are ancient debris made when the planets are forming. We are in the asteroid belt, you see. So, that is what asteroids are. Pieces of floating rock in space. Yes, Tindo, you got that right. Now, let's visit the next planet. Meet Jupiter. Hydrogen and helium make up its atmosphere. A day is just 10 hours here, but my year is 11.8 in Earth years. Pluto, I see now that time moves differently on every planet. Yes, Tindo, this is because of where the planet is in the solar system and how each planet moves. Let's go to Saturn, the next planet. My neighbor Jupiter and I to the naked eye are visible in the sky. I have four sets of rings that are wispy. I have seven wider rings, all bright and icy, first seen by Galileo Galilei. Prettiest of all planets, that's me. 82 moons keep me company. Wow, Satan, you clearly have a lot around you. It is very nice to meet you. Nice to meet you both. Hey, is it getting very cold? Oh, yes. We're now near the coldest planet out there, Tindo. My name is Uranus. Like my neighbors, I have rings, dark ones and bright ones. A total of 13. And I'm blue-green, caused by sunlight and methane. Hi, Uranus. Are you okay? Why are you moving sideways? I move almost 90 degrees on my side. This is how I rotate and I'm alright. That's a cool and different way to move, Uranus. It's good to meet you. We've come so far, Pluto. Are we approaching another star? I'm afraid not, my friend. But hey, here's our final planet. Here's Neptune, and it is 14 moons. I'm a bit rocky and mostly blue and icy. My six rings are very hard to see. That's because I'm the farthest planet. I'm away from the sun by 30 astronomical units. Say, aren't you further away by 39 astronomical units? They say. Hmm. Oh, Pluto, sometimes I'm the furthest away from the sun than Neptune, and sometimes I'm not because I move around. Well, Pluto, I've learned so much today about the planets. Thank you so much. And I enjoyed seeing the planets with you, Tindo. Bye, friends. See you next time.
time. Remember to like and subscribe.